I'm Taylor Swift. Hey, I'm Kix Brooks. Turn it up. American Country Show. K-F-M. Country Show, it's Kildare's KFM. Stephen with the Stetson here, kicking in with two hours of the finest American country music and kicking off with the man of the moment, Sam Hunt. What a win for him and what a win for country music in general. During the week at the American Music Awards, Sam picked up the new Artist of the Year. It's an opportunity to celebrate with a lot of the people who go back and, and high-five and hug all those, those, those folks and make sure that they know how much I appreciate them. Should be some party okay when he gets home to Nashville. Sam Hunt, big winner at the American Music Awards and other winners including Carrie Underwood, Luke Bryan and Florida Georgia Line all coming up tonight on American Country Show. We're chatting to the Shires as well. I met them during the week. That's Ben Earl and Chrissy Rhodes talking to them in the next 20 minutes. Also got a double shot tonight from Tim McGraw. I've got Eric Church's new song, Brad Paisley and some classic country from Blake Shelton coming up. First though, we'll play Chris Stapleton, huge winner at the CMAs only a few weeks ago and a song and an album inspired by his late father who died a couple of years ago. He said he went off on a road trip and that gave him the inspiration for the debut album. Here's the title track from it. It's called Traveller. It's Chris Stapleton on American Country Show. Kildare's KFM. I see the sunrise creeping in. Yeah, the band, the four of us has is, is been a little big town the entire yeah. time. Okay, we'll, we'll get to where we are now, uh, which is massive success, but it wasn't like that at the start, was it? Because you had a deal, and that kind of fell apart, didn't it? We've had many deals. <laughs> yeah, okay. Okay, well. In uh, this long of a career, we, uh, we yeah, you know, it's it's been... Um, a long, amazing journey, but it's definitely been difficult at times, and we, we've lost a couple of record deals. We lost um, one before we ever put music out, and then we had another record deal at Sony and uh, lost that, but then the next record we made on our own, and we were, we were actually on an independent label at that the time. That was James Black, wasn't it? Uh, yes. It was, yeah. Yeah. yes. Yeah. That's, that's where that we found our success, is yeah. on that record. You know, we finally got the label voices out of our head and started working really, you know, intensely with Wayne Kirkpatrick for the first time. And that record was when we wrote Boondocks yeah. and, and had the success and breakthrough. Yeah. Uh, and it, you know, it changed our lives. That label, of course, folded. Yeah. Um, <laughs> after it wasn't our, your fault. Uh, no, 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 we did about as much as you could do for someone. <laughs> we, we tried. and uh, But then, yeah, uh, Capitol Records picked up our record that we had made there and, and we moved on and we've been there ever since and it's been an un- unbelievable relationship. It them. certainly has, yeah. And does it make it all the more sweeter now with the Grammys and yeah, all the absolutely. success? Yeah, yeah. you know, when, when you've fought and struggled this many years and, and and we've seen the incredible things that have been happening happening over the past few years, it's it makes you appreciate it. You know, we've we've seen both sides of it for sure. Yeah, <laughs> take, take nothing for granted. Yeah, this is a all. pretty sweet time. Yeah. Uh, ride and we're loving every minute of it. American Country Show. Hi, this is Chris Young. Hi, this is Carrie Underwood. Hey, y'all, this is Jake Owen. We are the, the Band, Band Parent. Parent. You're listening to the American Country Show with Stephen Q on KFM. American Country Show, Kildare's KFM, 97.6, 97.3, and AmericanCountryShow.com online if you want to check out our website. We're also there on Facebook and Twitter. Uh, Tim McGraw coming up with two songs after nine o'clock. Double Shot Artists will play the new song and a classic Tim McGraw song. I mentioned Tim because there's a guy who's been writing songs recently for Tim McGraw, and now he is an artist in his own right. Chris Jansen, recent number one song, Buy Me a Boat. We're going to be chatting to the Shires, Ben and Chrissy on the way. More hot country next on KFM. We were so many friends who have like had songs yeah. on the show. Or we, we were friends with Sam Palladio who's on the show as well. So yeah, I mean, we're, we're almost Striking there. Matches that That's Gunnar. That, that, he's English, isn't he? Yeah, yeah. Sam. Yeah yeah, 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 yeah. He plays Gunnar. Gunnar. He's, he's, yeah. he's actually an amazing singer and songwriter as well. I wrote a song with him in Nashville, and mm. he's just really natural. Considering he's an actor as well, I mean, he's mm. just like. He's and he's got that country twang as well, which you you have. Do you do you get that? Do you do you have to create it yourself, or does it come naturally? Is that yeah? It's never been a thing we've tried. You don't sort of sing. I mean, I think most people naturally when they sing have a slight American accent wherever they're from. Um, but, you know, we've never, we never sit down and go, oh, let's sing that a bit more American. Never, like literally never, because mm. it would be sort of weird. But I think naturally when you're in Nashville, you do tend to write a bit more twangy sort of, <laughs> sort of, yeah. sort of songs almost. <laughs> let's fire out some quick questions for yeah. you, okay? Ben, last album you bought? Um, probably Blake Shelton's one, yeah. 
It's the latest one. Yeah, great. Oh, he's one, yeah. of, my, my, yeah. one of my favorites. Yeah, my own BU is one of my favorite songs of all time. Great song, yeah. yeah. Uh, Austin would be my, my Blake Shelton. Oh, really? See, I yeah. get into country way before you. Yeah. Funny, you, you mentioned uh, Lady Antebellum's Need yeah. You Now. For me, that Eureka moment was Garth Brooks' Unanswered Prayers. The coolest country. American Country Show. The American Country Show for is KFM 97.6, 97.3. Stephen Kerr here with more country favourites coming up in the next hour. The number one song in country is from Carrie Underwood and we've two from Tim McGraw, including his new song. Mr. Misunderstood is the title track from the new album from Eric Church, just dropped recently, as in dropped suddenly out of the blue without any warning. And that's great, the title track from the artist who's playing country to country. He'll be here in March of next year. Brad Paisley's coming to Dublin as well. He's playing in July. Uh, this is the new song from Moonshine in the Truck. It's called Country Nation on Kildare's KFM. Loading up another hour of hot American country. I got the I know that you're so done with them. Break up with them. Kildare's KFM. Don't forget you can check out our website, AmericanCountryShow.com. We're there on Facebook and Twitter as well. Playing the hottest country music every Saturday night. The full playlist is online as well if you want to check our website. Just to see you smile, 1997. What a country song that is from Tim McGraw. And before it, the new song from Tim is called Top of the World. Stephen Kyo here with the Stetson on playing your finest American country music tonight. And loving this new little big town. Here's Pain Killer, Kildare's KFM. Don't need no whiskey. American Country Show. American Country Show. More hot country. We're all Nashville writers. And how did you find it? Uh, a friend of mine pitched it to me. Yeah. Um, he, he found he's, he's friends with one of the guys, one of the writers. And um, I think it's, there was some big artist looking at it over there as well. So I'm just like, that's a song that I think will work here. So I'm going to so just So you go grabbed ahead. it first. I just grabbed it first and we'll see how it goes. Good stuff. This is great. It was our Sounds Like Nashville song last week. I was just saying that the Sounds Like Nashville slot, which we put in the American Country Show, was made for you, Pete. Great. So right. off, you, off you go. Take it away. <laughs> Sorry, honey, what you say? Uh... 